Hi guys, welcome to my fourth episode of Love the Bites series. My name is Samuel Kamochu, a telecoms and a software engineer for the last 13 years. I'm also the co-founder and a lead presenter at Meliora Technologies. In this episode, my focus is to help you appreciate what a beat and a bus is. A bit is basically a binary digit, the B in the word binary and the last two digits in the word digit that forms what we call a bit. So in the previous episode, we talked about how the word hello uh, can be coded into ASCII and how that can be represented in binary format. This gives us five characters, each represented as an eight bit number where the bit is basically a binary digit and that gives us about 40 bits of data. This data is what we send over the network or from one component to the other. Now that you know what a bit is, let's move on to the bus. And in the previous episode, we also looked at how two devices can communicate. Um, and we also looked at eight physical wires that uh, used to connect the two devices. And these wires is what we call a bus. So in this case, we have an eight bit bus, a bus that can carry eight bits at a go. So this means that the eight bits or the states can be powered on in the same clock cycle. The size of the bus is basically the number of bits that you can carry in the bus. So in this case, our bus is, the size of the bus is eight. Now, in the data that we had looked at, we have 40 bits, and these 40 bits, if you're using an 8-bit bus, then we'll have to send the data in five clock cycles, because in the first cycle, we'll send the 8 bits. In the second cycle, we'll send the next 8 bits until we get to the fifth cycle, where, where we send the last 8 bits. In total, we send 40 bits. So a bus is basically a communication system that transfers data between components inside a computer or between computers. Uh, this expression covers everything, including the hardware components and software. So you can also have a software bus. A hardware bus, we can look at the wires, just in the case that we have just studied. And you can also have a bus that utilizes the optical uh, fiber or even the wireless technology. Why is this important? A bus is a critical component in the digital communication. I'm sure you've heard about, you know, 32-bit or 64-bit computers. Uh, this bus influences the number of bits we can move at a go. So in case you have ever heard about a 32-bit computer, it may be using 32-bit address bus or basically bus. And in case you want to learn more about this, please, the next episode. In case this information sounds interesting to you or you think it could be beneficial to someone else, please share and feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you very much and see you again in the next episode.